This is the Movo Wireless Mini Di uh, wireless lapel or, or lavalier microphone set up here. It comes with this, this box here. It's rated at up to 165 feet. Unlike the other uh, similar knockoff brands offering up to 85 feet. This one is actually 65 feet. This one is rated at 165 feet, which is considerably longer. So in this box, it comes with a nice pouch, holding pouch for the uh, units. Now inside this pouch, we have the Movo receiver for iOS device for either iPhone or iPad and the transmitter or the microphone here. So what, how to, the setup is fairly straightforward and easy. Just need to do this, just grab your iPhone and plug in the transmitter to the port and then you unlock it and you press the power hold it, press and hold the power button on the transmitter. And when it sinks in solid blue, it means the transmitter and the receiver are connected. Now you're good to go. So I'm gonna quickly do some sampling testing through the mobile wireless microphone. Okay, this time I'm talking through the wireless lapel microphone right now as you can see it is being recorded on my iphone right now as you see the audio is being picked up and the receiver has solid blue light which means it is syncing with the transmitter or the microphone as you can see the waveform here as i'm speaking it will increase so the sound quality should be considerably different from my gopro mic which was used to record the introduction of this video. Now talking through the mobile wireless mic, there should be, it should be a lot more treble added to the mobile. Yeah, turn this back on, it's still recording. What you think about the sound quality of the mobile wireless mic? Is it too bright? Is it too, uh, too, too much of a treble? Other than that, the range works pretty well on the battery life five to five and a half hours just leaving it on overnight yeah so let me know what you think